Yo, we're back with a day in the life kind of video. I'm gonna show you what I'm doing throughout the day. We also have a crazy posing session, which I'm so hyped for because I'm competing in a bodybuilding show. I know that mic'd up TikTok kid is competing. So I just made my food. I'm about to show you all my supplements and then we're gonna go to the gym in a little bit, get a little pump, not work out, get a little pump, do a posing session, and then work out later with my homies. So spur of the moment video, you guys are gonna like it. A little sporadic ADHD type of video. Show you guys my subs and we'll keep moving forward. So I take D3, okay, but I need 10,000 IU. So I literally take 10 of these. I take K2 also, and there's I take five of these because I just got all the small capsules. These are like little like rabbit shits. <clears throat> On top of that, I take court ease. This helps my cortisol levels. Why are you so obsessed with me? Boy, I wanna know. Take one of these one of these from a lucid blend of ashwagandha. This helps my anxiety levels. It also increases testosterone. On top of that, I take Estrocorp. Healthy estrogen balance. Healthy stress and mood. Reduced water retention. I bet that has a big part of it. Um, my coach says I should take this. I also take creatine. All right, not gonna lie, I'm definitely out of beef, so I'm gonna run to the store, grab beef, come back, make it, and somehow make it on posing session in 45 minutes. Let's go to Walmart. But one thing I've never understood about Walmart, like, workers, is, like, whenever you check out, you walk out and they look at your receipt, and, like, I, how are they gonna look at all my items in time real fast? Like, she just examined... Like, she definitely looked at all my items, but, whoa, pause. Like, she examined my ticket and looked at that. I got two things about say I got two things of beef. She's like, oh, okay, okay, okay. And I walk out, bro, and I walk out, and this dude like, is about to hit me with his car. He's going quick as fuck. And I back up, and he goes, and I'm like, bro, what? And that cop walks up, and he's like, she's going to run you over, aren't they? I was like, literally, that's why you're here. Protect me, bro. And then I get out there, and he wants to see my parking spot because I got front row up in this bitch. And bro tried to go up to the front, and he tried to go behind my car and almost hit me, bro, so fucking close. Started so backing up, so I'm revving the fuck out of my car, backing up. I'm like, like backing up, I'm like, fucking asshole me I am, but wow, words. Okay, so revving the fuck out of my car, and that's when I just wish my car would pop. I wish I had a tune on it so I could go, bah, 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 like right in that motherfucker's face. All right, let's go make food. Shit! All right, so on my rice, I'm instructed to put on six turns of this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Himalayan salt. Because we are literally like tracking our sodium on a cut. If you have low sodium on a cut, you're gonna feel terrible. Also guys, this is how sad this is. Hope just texted me and she sent me pictures of herself. She said, what's wrong with me? Like she's crying doing her workout. She said, I can't stop crying while I'm working out. She's on that low calorie, 800 calories here, 850. I said, all right, two sets of everything, 12 reps, take it easy, just get the work in, get a pump in, and then do your cardio. And then she has work after that too, so that's a lot of shit. Guys, she's going fucking through it right now. All right, I have like 10 minutes to get to the gym after eating this, and I also got a package in order to bring, which we'll do that in a second, so I'll see you guys at the gym. What's your experience with posing so far? I like to think I'm pretty good. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm not, I, I'll we'll see. I can show you what I've been doing as my like practice. We can start with men's physique first, and then we can roll your shorts up in a bit. So let's let, let's see your mandatory men's physique. Let's okay, so this one I don't have those practice on, but. I see your back pose. Follow me, we're gonna go shoulder width apart. What you wanna do is you don't wanna have a thigh gap. So you see how you have a little bit one right there? You may need to angle those toes outwards, okay? Push to the ground, wake up the quads. Now we're just gonna flare the lats. We're gonna hit it like that. You can choose to hit a vacuum in that pose too. That look like nuts. So I'm just like this. Mm -hmm. Like that? Sure. <laughs> I mean, I can go. We're, like just, we're just getting baseline right now. I'm trying to see what like what we need to practice on. Okay. So posing routines are dope. You know, like I do a ton of them. They look cool. Yeah. They don't fucking matter to be honest, which kind of sucks, right? Okay. We wish that they would. But what really matters is your mandatories, right? Okay. That's what you get judged off of. If you do an NPC show, if you're not doing somewhere shredding, only the top five guys get to do a, get to do a posing routine. Okay. <laughs> Whatever side you feel most comfortable. With. And you can choose to vacuum in this as well. But I would show your abs first. See so your vacuum now? Okay, and then favorite classic pose, you get to pick one. It can be any pose you like. Okay, the left foot, we never want to be behind this leg, okay? So you either want to be parallel or slightly in front. Now we're going to go on our toe on this foot. Now we're like this, we're going to just bend that knee a little bit and sink our weight into the right side. Now with our waist, we're going to just kind of sink into that hip with it. Okay. Blow out that air. 
and now hit the foot. Much better. Cool. Good. Good shit. It's a great pose. And you can extend these elbows just a little bit. Right, so relax. One thing you don't want to do is you don't want to chop off your pose. Well, I guys hit this like this. If I'm able to open up the elbows a little bit more, it doesn't do anything in my back, but it makes me appear like I have a wider look. Okay. Rotate. There you go, rotate those arms down just a bit. Pushing through the balls of our feet, our toes and our heels to wake up the part of the quads. Rotate that butt back slightly. Right, we can just slowly lower those arms a little bit. Okay, this arm we can bring up higher, right, in the aspect of bending more of our elbow. Bend that elbow a little bit more. Tall chest. Tall chest here. Flex the glutes, hamstrings. And then you lean back slightly, but keep those glutes and hamstrings flexed. Open up those elbows a little bit more. Good. And you killed that. Yeah, that's my good side of my abs. You killed that one. Huh. Yeah. Okay, cool. You can relax. Same thing, like push this right leg out since you're leaning on your right leg. This foot here, we're going to touch those adductors together, but go on our toe. More knee bend. Flex your biceps more. When I wedge in that leg, I wrap it all the way facing over here to get my hamstring to pop more. Hit your abs. Bring the left foot out, place a little bit of pressure on that back leg. Pose. More weight on this leg. Good, you can lean back a little bit more, flex the glutes, hamstrings. So let's lean more into this side more. And then we want to go on our toe here opposed to our heel. So put pressure on your toe. Right, so what you see here is the top part of your quad wakes up. Now crunch down those abs. And then hit Can we go back. here? Yes. Or here? I think in your case you could crunch down a bit more. That's it. All right, we just got back in the car. We got done posing. The hopes on the phone. Hope say hey. Hey. God, that was loud. Okay, um, I also, I just packaged, look how trashy my car is, it's so bad. But I did package like nine orders. I have to go drop off all those orders. We're gonna eat another meal. We're gonna eat our Pop-Tart. We're gonna come back and work out with a video of that. Blah, blah, blah. Let's go drop off this order. Let's go home. Okay, thank you so much. That was well. I'm about to make some food. I'm gonna add some TikToks. And then we're gonna go to the gym. We just made another round of beef and rice, and it's, yeah, the same thing as earlier, but it's just more rice this time, and then we're gonna have a Pop-Tart and go to the gym, that's probably workout snack. All right, so meal is finished, and so I get to pull into my favorite box and pull out a Pop-Tart. We're about to eat this on the way to the gym, take our pre-workout, I'm gonna show you guys my favorite pre, it's a god tier pre. Me and Hope literally drink this every single time. We're kinda like an all black vibe today, so we got the black shirt, this is from At Peace, this is Fearless on the back, shit is hard. Also, I have a tight tank from Young LA, Shit's hard. It's kind of like a stringer on the back, but like a like a regular beater on the front. But it has like the good mesh, not mesh, but like stretchier material. And like it's like Nike parachute pants. And then my fours, my military fours, uh, they're hard. Okay. Oh my god, that was crazy. I was out. Look at that. This is how much I use it, guys. With the peach pumps pump. With the peach pumps pump formula. Basically, what I do is like the pre is good on pump stuff, but adding pump is definitely the move. The pre just has the caffeine. Yeah, it's just gas. Best combo you'll ever have out of any group workout in the world. I'll fall in Coach Groove. All right, so I just got to the gym, okay? We're in the Alpha Land parking lot. I've been sitting here for a solid 30 minutes because I'm trying to work out my schedule to go see Hope next week. And she thinks I'm coming late. I just booked my flight to go Tuesday and we go to her show on Friday and I'm gonna leave Wednesday. So I'll be, I'll be able to hang out there for a long time. I always wish I stayed longer whenever I book my trip. So I made it like a, like a second eight day trip. Yeah, that's dope. All right, let's go work out. I'm about to cue a little workout video, put a tripod up, you're gonna see it. Let's see how we do it. Don't 
That is all for the day in life of prep, nine weeks out. I will see you guys in the next video, which will be coming very soon with Chris Franco. Not a vlog style, just a regular video. Appreciate you guys watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Have a good one. I appreciate y'all always.